And we are starting. Hello everyone, I am Mr. Rain, and today I am joined with Orion the Starhawk. Hello. Yeah. And so we're going to be playing Subnautica. Mainly I am. And I'm going to be his uh, little AI helper that's more helpful than the in-game AI helper. Yes, because that's very much an issue. <laughs> Considering the primary AI is mainly just snarky and not very helpful unless it's extreme emergency. Indeed. Okay, so I guess I'll just start. But in time, um, if you want the true experience, I'd recommend survival. Okay. Um, I'll either tell you where you should be going and exactly what it is you're looking for and warn you of imminent danger before you get there. I'll only warn you of imminent danger when you're already probably on top of it, or I'll give you subtle hints. Your move. We'll see. <laughs> Subtle hints, I think, is probably where I'll be starting. Okay, so subtle hints will warn you. Uh, will will warn you in this in the manner of, I would probably do this, and mm -hmm. I would not advise going there. You'll probably die. Yeah, that's good. Just I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and be in vague as as vague as possible. Yeah, a danger detector would definitely be. The most helpful. Windwakes, thank you for the follow. That was a host. The host? host. Okay. It basically means they're running your stream on their channel, so you're getting a little extra publicity. Ah. Okay, it's showing on the activity feed that was a follow, but if it's host, then by all means. Even better. This, however. That. Oh, that one's a follow. You gotta remember, I got a little stream lag. Right. Ow. Oof. Okay, yeah, definite definite mild amount of lag. Um hmm. You're gonna have to tell me what it is you plan on doing and then <laughs> I'll let you know if it's safe or not. Okay. Well, I just picked up a... Okay, you don't have to give there me a go. play by play. I mean like <laughs> locations. Yeah, yeah. Like okay, I'm okay. gonna go over here or I'm gonna go in this direction or things like that. As thanks to a certain Irishman who has a high five thing, I have this game almost memorized. Nice. 50, 25 percent of your health. Oh, you can move. Wow. Okay. I hate that. So the inventory isn't a pause menu. That kind of sucks. No, no, it is not. <laughs> I'm going to make that mistake a lot. Oh yeah. So you can either. At the moment, there's not really much for you to do, so you can either exit through the top or through the, the floor. You're tall. I don't... Okay. It's, it really doesn't make a difference. It's just a different cinematic for each one. For the record, the birds are harmless. I'll tell you that much right now. <laughs> it looks like a pterodactyl at first. To be honest with you. Like a pterodactyl mix or a giant moth, but... <laughs> it's a friggin' humongous moth, man. Dude, if you go to the country, you're going to see some big moths. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, so like I said, nothing here, nothing here. Just the, the only thing you can really do right now is just go into the deep, dark, deep, deep down, dark, deep down. All right. God, how does he say that like that? <laughs> and we're off towards the... Aurora, I would presume. Um, did you wait? Did you just say you want to head for the Aurora right off the bat? I'm swimming in between it, but I'm not at it yet. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm I'm not gonna deadpan it. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm like I'm just gonna be as as flat out as possible. Don't do that yet. Okay. Like you, <laughs> this right, is the so one time I'll be flat out. I'll be flat out. Don't go towards the Aurora. There you. are reapers around there, like there eight of them. So, so unless you want a quick and painful death, don't. 
There should be little arrow prompts telling you what it is you should be doing. Well, I broke a piece of limestone and it fell through the world, so that's good. Through the world? Yeah, you're going to see it in a second. Okay, uh... Hey, devs. <clears throat> <laughs> Add that to the list. Don't don't worry, I'm not going to tell you everything. <laughs> like, for example, I didn't tell you where. I uh, don't like that noise at all. What noise? Oh, but what? Uh, okay, that was strange and confusing. Red, red looking puffer fish. Oh, oh, the crash fish. Oh, you're going to love, you're going to learn to love them. Climb, climb. Thank you. Uh, hi, Beard. Thank you for the follow. Press F6. What would F6 do? I have no clue. <laughs> Should I really? Hi, are you trolling? I know you I'm... enough to know that you typically don't troll, but. I know it's not the whole Alt F4 thing. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> Press Alt F4. No thanks. Oh, F6 gets rid of my mask overlay. Oh, that's it? It just gets rid of the mask? Hmm. Oh, I see. It gets rid of your player model. So you can have a more cinematic view. Oh. <laughs> now... Let's cook the fish. I just noticed that the sparks were clipping through the bottom of that thing. Oh boy. Mm. It's amazing how much, like, little details you tend to notice when you're yeah. not the one playing it. <laughs> Tab is inventory. I keep pressing I like I'm playing Minecraft. Don't you? <laughs> You don't even play Minecraft. I used to. Not often, but I used to. That's the only thing I've played that's similar to stuff like this. So the power <laughs> except there was, like Except there was no underwater when you were playing. I stayed very far. Oh, jeez. The cinematics, man. Leave me alone. What, I did the little rabbit race scare you? <laughs> And see, it's getting dark now, so it's also oh. happening. Oh, yeah, you're going to hate that. You're telling me dark and water do not mix for me. Dude, you told you like on Saturday, you told me water doesn't mix for you. <laughs> exactly. So this is just. Let me get more food. Can I? Yeah, yeah I can just keep you there. <laughs> Arxy was your work. Hey, it works. I can propel myself. Cool. Okay, you're not just gonna hide in the. You're not <laughs> just gonna hide in the life pod until daybreak, are you? I was thinking about it. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> okay. Uh... <laughs> Come on, man. Okay, maybe this will bring you a little solace. <laughs> the name of the location you're currently in, and yes, the biomes have names, you are literally in the safe shallows. Okay. The only thing that might hurt you, and I honestly haven't even seen them yet, are very green and very bulbous. And they're not even hostile. They just hurt you by passiveness. Don't ask me how. Very brave. <laughs> just don't veer away from the life pod and you'll live. For the record, you cannot eat the acid mushrooms, so don't even try. <laughs> I got a boomerang. Just pretty much same as the paper, it's just food. Mm -hmm. Although it does look a little little better. <laughs> in terms of design. Unfortunately, he does not act as a flashlight despite the luminescent tips. In fact, none of these things act as a flashlight. Except the actual flashlight, nudge, nudge, wink, wink, hint, hint. Yeah, is it like every other game and it's set for flashlight? Nope. R, E, nope. You hey. don't have it on you, you have to build it. Of course. Bro, I told you, you don't start <laughs> out with a lot. Everything is underwater, you have to find and construct. I 
I would also advise staying away from the seaweed to start off. Yeah, I was just trying to see if there's anything here that I could grab. Doesn't look like it. I don't know if there's anything you can grab because it's very dark, but I know that there's something that'll try and grab you. Uh-huh. <laughs> Wait, what's this here? Hey, daylight. I can see again. Okay. Slightly better. <laughs> ah, divenya. <laughs> Okay, I see the bulb was screened. Yeah, they don't Let's attack see. you, but um, let's just say they get very gassy. Yeah. You okay, man? You're kind of... <laughs> you, you, you're looking around right sporadically. Now. Like, you don't trust me? <laughs> I don't trust anything that's in the water. <laughs> Except the obviously harmless fish. Exactly. <laughs> it's going to take a while for me to get used to this. Literally testing the waters and all that good stuff. <laughs> Not a fan of this. Okay. I'll get over <laughs> it eventually. <laughs> eventually. I'm half tempted but to have tools. you save and then just swim towards the ship just so you can see one of the worst things you'll run into today. No. It... <laughs> nah. I'm good. You're going to have to go over there eventually. It's literally unavoidable. Yeah, when I have tools and whatnot to work with, I will. I think you're more terrified of this than anything else, if I'm perfectly honest with you. I pretty much am. Oh boy, this ought to be fun. <laughs> like, here's a slight click in the corner, his head just... Whoop. Oh, yeah. Believe me, I use sound a lot. Oh boy. So, any anything that I hear is just going to freak me out. See anything else I can build with what I have? Then I may I make a slight suggestion. Sure. Turn off the music, because a lot of people tend yeah. to mistake some certain sound effects in the music for actual danger. Yes. That like, would... don't get me wrong, the soundtrack is amazing, but if you've got like hydrophobia, I would severely <laughs> advise against it. Yes, definitely. Thank you for that. Let me save. While I'm at it. I don't think you can turn off the ambient volume. I think that's actually the creature sound effects. Yeah, that would not be a good thing to turn off. Like, Reaper out of nowhere. <laughs> Why? Because you didn't hear him coming. <laughs> <laughs> 